Hello and welcome. This is Darius Barasande, host of the U.S. Revolution. And if you're about to watch this amazing session that we did, then you're part of a group of humans on this planet who are ascending and moving into a higher frequency. You're not here by accident, and I'd like to offer you a special gift that will help you to adjust to some of these frequencies, plug in even deeper, and it's an energy activation MP3 that will double the power of your energy field in less than 57 seconds. It's absolutely free, and it's the first link in the description down below, but it's also going to let you get to hear calls like this one live and get daily help from healers, teachers, and masters all over the world. It's absolutely free and it's part of what we're doing every day at UAuth Revolution. So if you feel called in your heart, you can click the link down below and the special session that you wanted to watch and experience will start right now. One, one question that's coming up a lot is there are single people on the call who are sort of asking, well, how do I attract that person into my life. What do I need to do? Uh, okay. Any thoughts? Yes, oh, absolutely. Yeah. In fact, that, <laughs> that gets very much into the experiential thing that I mentioned. So would it be an appropriate time to go ahead and, and do a five-minute experiential exercise and then talk about that a little bit? Oh, it would be perfect. Yeah, I can't wait. Let's okay. do it. Okay. So everyone on the line, whether you're single or, or a member of a couple, but it, particularly if you're a single person right now, there are two specific things that we have found that are something that people really need to do, and they need to do it in a certain way. Um, uh, in our relationship programs, like the Relationship Catalyst, for example, part of the program helps you do these two things, but I want to give you a a kind of a capsule summary of what they are and show you how to do them in your own conscious of your own um, consciousness. So one of them is to find the place in you that out of which you're attracting relationships that either don't work or aren't right for you. And mm. then I want to show you a new way of figuring out what you really want in your close relationships. So I'm going to kind of compress something that usually takes, you know, 40 minutes or so into just a shorter thing because I know you're a very advanced group and you can uh, move through it quickly with me. But just think for a moment of some of the relationship issues, dramas, conflicts, and so forth that you've had over the years. And particularly notice if you can think of any that have kind of recycled. In other words, uh, three relationships that have kind of broken up the same way. Or, you know, like I had a fellow come in one time who had had 13 different relationships where he got left abruptly and he was able to make a connection suddenly, you know, and he was finally able to connect that with a, an abandonment situation early on. And then he went on to move past that and didn't create those kind of relationships anymore. So it's mm -hmm. worth it to spend a few minutes kind of clearing some space in here. So just call to mind some of your relationship history there so you have some fresh feeling and memories in your body. And then what I'd like you to do is take a moment to realize that inside all of us, there is a part of us that's capable of loving ourselves and a, cap a part of us that's capable of beating up on ourselves, of being critical of ourselves, of even keeping ourselves trapped in old patterns. And what I want you to do now is bring forth that part of yourself that's capable of loving. Even, even if it's a homeopathic drop of love you can feel right now. But I want you to bring forth that part of yourself, that loving part of yourself, by thinking of a person that you absolutely know for sure that you love. So bring to mind a person right now. They could be living or perhaps they've passed on, but you know for sure you love that person. And also think of something you absolutely know for sure you love to do. Perhaps walking on the beach at sunset or standing on a mountaintop. But just take a moment to call to mind something that you know for sure that you love to do. And tune into your body and feel what that kind of love feels like. That the way you love that person you know for sure you love. 
And the way you love doing that thing you know for sure you love to do. Just feel that feeling in your body. And now generously give that feeling to yourself. Love yourself for everything you are and everything you are not in relationship. Love yourself for it all. Take a moment to give yourself pure, unconditional love for everything that's happened for you and hasn't happened for you that you've wanted to happen in the area of love. But now I want you to love it instead of feeling bad about it. And if you do still feel bad about it, love your feeling bad about it. Because the beautiful thing about love that I want you to know more than anything else is that love has the power to heal because it can contain its opposite. Love is big enough to contain the unlovable in ourselves. And if we will just take that tenth of a second or ten seconds to love ourselves exactly as we are, especially that unlovable part of ourselves, then that frees us up. So just take a moment and love yourself as you are for about ten silent seconds. Ten seconds is about time enough to take one very long, slow, easy breath in and out. So here's why that's so powerful. It's powerful because if you haven't loved yourself for that little ten seconds or whatever it takes to juice up that unloved part of yourself, if you haven't loved that part of yourself, you will tend to attract people also who don't love themselves and then you'll try to get each other to do it for you even though you aren't doing it yourself and it becomes kind of like a dog chasing its own tail around in a relationship where two people who don't love themselves try to get the other person to love them and so of course the law of manifestation says that you're going to attract vibrationally what you're experiencing inside so it's important to bathe yourself in that experience of love for everything that you've been and haven't been in the past. So that's number one. The number two thing, though, is to put in a little thought time. Go for a walk and see if you can figure out in the area of relationship what your three absolute yeses and your three absolute noes are. In other words, what are the three things that are most important to you in a relationship and what are the three things that are most important for you not to have in a relationship? And as I said, this is kind of an extract of a very long process from one of our programs, but that gives you the basic idea that you can carry out on your own that you can do two things. You can open up and start getting in the process of loving yourself, especially the unconditionally I mean, the unlovable part of yourself, bring that unconditional love to it. And number two, figuring out clearly what your three absolute yeses and three absolute noes really are. Hello and welcome. This is Darius Barzani, host of the Wealth Revolution. And if you enjoyed that snippet of one of our interviews, I'd invite you to just scroll down for one second and click the link down below. You're going to get access not only to a free gift that's gonna double the power of your energy field in just 57 seconds, you're also gonna to get to be a part of the US Revolution and listen to interviews just like the ones you heard that are happening live right now, daily, where I interview some of the top healers, teachers, and masters in the field of energy transformation, energy healing, consciousness, ascension, and more. Plus, you're gonna to get to be on live calls where you'll get your questions answered, you'll get to submit them via webcast, you'll even get to be one-on-one -on -one, live on the phone and get energy healing help daily. It's all part of what we've been doing. So get up to date, click the link, join and be a part of it. And if you enjoyed this video or you like to see more of it, click the like button or subscribe. I always upload new content and I give weekly energy updates. So please let us know how we can serve you. And thanks for watching and being in my life. Much love.